This may look like a normal electric guitar, but it was actually 3D printed. In this video, we'll see how I made it, what's so special about it, and how it sounds. I designed the guitar using Fusion 360, and you may be wondering what those three attachments are, and I'll get to that later in the video. The guitar was printed in separate pieces, and I epoxied them all together. The center sections, where the stress will be the greatest, were printed extra strong. Next, I puttied and sanded the guitar. I also inserted some carbon fiber rods into the body to make it even stronger. After many layers of primer and sanding, I finally achieved a finish that I was happy with. The speaker cabinet is also 3D printed. Now you may be wondering, what's so special about this guitar, besides the fact that it's 3D printed? It's actually the wiring and the electronics inside the guitar that allow you to insert your own custom guitar pedal modules. Basically, these allow you to change the sound of your guitar. The design for these was inspired by old Nintendo game cartridges. You could turn each effect on and off using the toggle switches on the front of the guitar. The guitar pedals ended up being a huge challenge and I'm still working on getting them to work perfectly. The problem is I've never built an electric guitar before and for my first one I decided to build the guitar, the pedals, and the amp. I could potentially make an update video for the guitar effect modules. They're a ton of work but I think it'll be really cool. The guitar itself works perfectly and it plays and sounds very nice. Here's how it sounds on a clean setting. Now let's test it out with some distortion. Classic rock and roll is fun, but can it play jazz? printing really opens up a whole new world of opportunity for projects. It's fun to push the limits and to see what's possible. Thanks for watching and happy printing. If you liked this video, please consider supporting me on Patreon. I have a link in the description below.